If dirty or smelly water enters the dishwasher between cycles, or if water pumps out of the dishwasher during the wash cycle, the cause could be because there is neither an air gap nor a high drain loop installed. GE dishwashers require either an air gap or a high drain loop to prevent these issues from occurring. Look to see if an air gap is installed and that the dishwasher is properly connected to it. If there is no air gap installed, check to see if there is a high drain loop in the drain hose of the dishwasher. A high drain loop is formed by the drain hose being fastened to the underside of the countertop. This performs the same task as an air gap, but is much easier and less costly to install. If there is no air gap installed, find the drain hose that connects the dishwasher and the household plumbing. Look to see if it is fastened to the underside of the countertop at any point along its path. If it is, measure the height at the highest point. It should reach at least 32 inches above the floor of the room. If there is neither an air gap nor a high drain loop present, one or the other will need to be installed. If a high drain loop is desired, check to make sure the underside of the counter is at least 32 inches above the floor. If not, a high drain loop will not be acceptable and an air gap will need to be installed. For this task, GE recommends the service of a professional plumber. To install a high drain loop, use a bracket large enough to fit around the drain hose, which is available at any local hardware store. Place the drain hose in the bracket. Screw the bracket to the underside of the counter. Be careful not to puncture or damage the drain hose. For marble, granite, or other hard surface countertops, the hose should be fastened on a side of the inside of the cabinet, 32 inches above the floor level.